Greetings friends and welcome back. It is time for another playthrough of Grounded. My goal for this series will be a true uncut experience to 100% the game but in half the time as my last run. We're going to keep things on normal difficulty uh, because I'm not sure I'm ready for woe mode yet. So what that means is we're trying for a 37 day 100% completion. As a secondary goal, I'm going to try to see if I can get through without any deaths. I don't really think that one's possible. Actually, I don't even think 37 days is possible, but we're going to try, and I enjoy that challenge. I hope you'll join me. Please don't forget that like button, and if I earn it, please consider subscribing. <sighs> Can't remember what happened. Hey, where am I? What the heck is this place? Everything seems so big. Whoa. All right, we're going to start this off the same way we do every time, and that is to grab absolutely everything in sight. Signal detected. Buzzer! Whoa. Especially those mushrooms. Delicious and nutritious. Maybe it's coming from nearby. Getting real. You got this, Hoops. That's a quick little fella. <laughs> kind of cute, too. Whoa, where are you headed, Ann? All right, let's go do a little bit of analyzing. I'm guessing this isn't the only one of these science pods. I should keep searching and see what else I Always can start off with the pebblet that unlocks your spear and your uh, axe. I like to do the fiber next. Unlock the crude rope and grab that. Which in turn unlocks your hammer. And in my opinion, those are the three things that you want to get right away. Uh, if you're trying to be efficient. I'm sure that the... There's other things that you could get as well, but... Hey, did that not make my axe? All right. Let's put everything where I like it, which has no rhyme or reason other than muscle memory. And I think I'll put food in number three right now. Yeah, we'll take some dry grass, sure. Why not? All right. Does that Got a pretty good. Asthma? Can get asthma? Pretty good, good. Pretty good little start there. Um, liking the way this is going so far. Let's go clear out the uh, the power cable over here. Uh, we want to make sure that we get enough uh, weevil meat and aphid meat for our slippers and shield. Although I don't see that really being a problem. There's plenty to go around. Normally I work on Lil Fist here. But we're trying to be quick. And I don't have armor, so if I mess up, that could be a... Uh, could end up taking a lot of damage I don't want to. Extra sap here. We'll loot all these guys on the way out. Uh, can I make my torch? Beautiful. Let's see what's sneaking around here. A 
We'll grab some of this slime mold to analyze at some point. That's a decent amount of mite fuzz. Wow, we got the gold card already? Are you serious? Uh, that's pretty amazing. I will tell you, I have seen people on uh, YouTube and Reddit both that are 400 kills in and they still can't get the gold card. So, uh, that's pretty amazing. I'll take it. Uh, I wasn't paying attention. How many Weevil meats do we have? There's four. All right, cool. Oh, come on. Let's go. Alright, so our next goal is grass, so we can make a workbench. And that will allow us to craft armor. Uh, which right now, really all we want is... Aphid slippers. Uh, craft and equip. Yes. All right. Oh, you know what? I need another spear. I wonder if I should make two. Let's just go. We're gonna stick with uh, two total right now. Is that a basketball court? Right. This is the blade of grass we need to chop down, so we'll take care of that real quick. I was a fool to have ever doubted myself. A fool like Klein, like Kaminsky, like Schmetter, like all of Abonnant. Giant explosion machine. Peeping on that ladybug would be a menace boxing out in the paint. All right, let's uh, discover the ice caps here. Sounds like it's all clogged up. Uh, oh, I hear a gnat. There you are. Come on, got him. So our focus now is going to be taking down red ants. Uh, I want to get at least two soldiers. And you know, actually, I think it only takes three spears. Maybe it's four uh, to kill a soldier ant. Hey. Wow, that ant is yoked. All right, well, we were out of stamina and I didn't want to start a fight that close to the ant hill just in case. Uh, see, there you are. Oh, I just wanted one of you. Oh, yeah, I'm just gonna throw spears at you. Oh, man. Isn't too bad. I'll take that. Um, ooh, how many acid glands do we get? Oh, we only got one. Okay. I know they can drop, I think I've seen them drop three before. Uh, we only need two to make the uh, the chest piece. Yeah, come over here. I don't want to fight all your buddies right now. Ow. 
Yeah, see that time he dropped three. Yeah, I'll take it. All right, we do probably still need to kill a couple of the worker ants to get some red ant parts. Uh, so we will do that as well. Wait, have I peeped the workers? Okay. Hey, you. Yeah, you. What? What did I do to you? Alright. Health is getting a little low there. What's that put us at? Eight ant parts? Oh, that can't be enough. Hey, you. Thank you. Puts us at ten. Oh, uh, I feel like that's close. Let's go find out. Plus, I want to make a bandage. Can I get extra credit for this? Our poor aphid slippers already down to half. That didn't take long. Okay, did we? We have not. So there's that. Going to do this guy too. Okay, craft and equip. Craft and equip. And wow, we need four more. We need two more might fuzz. Oh man. Well, that's a major bummer. Uh, where's that water at? Sure. Feeling refreshed. All right, we'll go get our two more might fuzz. Here I am trying to be efficient, having to do the same trip multiple times. Hey, can I make a bandage at least? Okay, I like those in number seven because it's a nice, easy left direction from my hot bar. That. So I am spending a little bit of time killing these because we're going to need them to repair gear. We also need them to craft other stuff and they're all right here. Might as well. I miss Natural Explorer already. Ah, oh, man. So that's why you gotta hit him once first. Dang it. Hey, we're buddies, right? Hey, do you drop red ant parts, actually? Uh, I don't think he did. What? Why are you mad at me? I didn't do anything. Alright, an unfortunate detour because I wasn't prepared for exactly what I needed for the gear. Let's go ahead and go make our red ant britches. Uh, 
Okay. Boy, I tell you what. This has been an incredible waste of time already. Ants coming through. I wanted to fight. Huh. Why not? It's there. Dang, are we already getting to the end of the day? just going to do a quick run through here. Uh, we'll grab stuff that's on the way, but really the goal is to just get in, get the chip, uh, and get out. Bam! Alley hoops! Bringing the light! Guess we'll wear, or bring out our hammer. We'll go ahead and go this way. Stink bugs above us. Oh, I suppose we'll grab our B gear while we're at it. I don't think this was necessarily the fastest way, but uh, I know there's a lot more quartzite this way, so I kind of wanted to do that. Uh, there's usually a 500 raw science in the water as well. Uh oh, a couple right here too. Or one right here. Uh, okay, take that. Thank you. Uh, there you are. Thank you again. Thank you. Did I grab it? I'm beat. Let's find someplace safe and catch some Z's. Oh, can't take that yet. Where's the water? Okay, there should be a raw science in here. Nice. All right. Let's head back. See if we can get to Burgle before nightfall. If you're ever trying to get out of an anthill, they make sure that the up is up and the down is down, so just try to go uphill. You'll eventually find your way out. Yeah, I really don't care about these eggs, do I? How much room do I have? 
Ah, what the heck. Kind of want to drop them over by the uh, stink bug and see if they'll actually kill it. I don't think they will, but it would be amusing. Heading towards the tree now. Uh, since we're out of combat, I'm gonna throw on my aphid slippers. Probably just do it right now, actually. Armoring up. What? What a rip! We're not here to fight. We're here to run. We do, just not really at the moment. But she's probably coming around right now, so let's be quick. Oh yeah, still have all these dang eggs. How many aphids is that? Mm, can't waste food. Can't waste food. Mm, can't waste food. Alright, where are you at, little stinker? Uh, he's usually right about in here, right? Whatever. Uh, is that a ripe, ripened dandelion? Oh, I see the grass moving. There he is. Hey, don't fall towards him, would you? All right, we got our dandelion tuft. See if we can get out of here alive. Let's discover some locations here. Nice. Uh, can I make a shovel? Yes, I can. Thank you very much. We'll put that right there. Hello. Thank you for your sacrifice. Whatever's rumbling down there, I'm gonna stomp on it. No, we're gonna stab it with a spear. Because that's how we roll. Alright, let's get into Burgle. Uh, hopefully, we get some quests that we can do before. 
to change a day. I'm totally going the wrong way here. I'm ready to go home now. Hey, did I peep you yet? Okay. That glowy thing looks like some real nerd stuff. All right, let's do... I want to get this gear analyzed because then I can just get rid of it. Like, I'm never going to use it. Uh, but I do like the brain power, so... Uh, there's that. Got the tape, too. I have isolated the source of the particle irregularities. They appear to be a byproduct of the shrinking process. If I adjust the machine to account for their existence, it should be the key to the de-shrinking, uh, expanding process. Virgil, please bring up the readings for the irregular covalent SNPI 42Z particle traces. Ugh, that name is going to get tiresome. And while you're at it, rename all references to the irregular covalent SNPI 42Z particle to raw science. Thanks for the helping hand! I am Burgle, acting science manager for this project. I am also a robot. Hmm. What can we get rid of? I am sure oh, this all must that. be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. Can we uh, hard part for me was a controller. This fine motor skills. I suspect Quickest conversation you've ever had. We're gonna jump for joy. All right, we'll give a little biometric scan. All right, Great Oak Beacon, Trowel Gulch, Cloverhood. Man, we might be able to do all those before nightfall. Uh, can I upgrade my bandages? No, not yet. Well, let's do a torch upgrade at least. Oh, you know what? That's because he doesn't know that I have an auxiliary chip. Now we can upgrade our bandages. Nice. Alright, what time is it? 2028 so we've got we got a few hours to get these quests done before the new ones pop that's a little exciting so I think I'm gonna go ahead and uh, build over by this field station um, I've never actually built here before but I want to be able to get to the quests and stuff whenever necessary Safety first. Uh, I also don't want to build in the tree again. I think that was a little bit too easy. And over here, I know it's still kind of up and out of the way. But I know that the uh, wolf spider and the orb weavers can still mess with us while we're up there. So we'll try it out. We'll see what happens. Really? Oh man. Uh, sure. We don't need acorn bits, right? Uh, yeah, we'll probably just build right here. Let's go grab some grass. Do I have room for clover? Do I already have clover? I don't. What can I drop? Looks like i uh, got some extra grub meat there.
Uh, oh, I do have three. Okay. Hydration is the key to performance. Definitely gonna have to figure out a faster way to get up here. That's okay. We'll figure it out when the time comes. Uh, let's see, workbench. Thank you very much. Uh, how about storage? What? Do I have acorns? I do. Need to analyze them. That's the problem. All right, how about a storage chest? Very nice. I'll just put pretty much everything in there. Uh, I switched my hot deposit key to right button. I tried to put away my weapon before I threw it, but apparently that didn't work. Uh, yeah, let's throw that in there. Okay, what are we on time? Doing on time 22.30. Okay, so we gotta pick this up a little bit. Uh, so what was it, a clover hood? Okay, that is done. Uh, we're gonna need two clover. Just take a stack of those bad boys. Where are my sprigs? Oh, I've got them on me. All right, so we've got to get up here. I think we'll be able to do this. Get all three quests done before the switch of the days. I did peep you, right? Okay. These gnats are more annoying than my little brother. Come on. Okay, Trowel Gulch is. I think it's that one right there. All right, if we want to get there before daybreak, we got to hustle. Not daybreak, but the switching of the days. New quests, that kind of stuff. We discovered you. Thank you very much. Oh, I hear that stink bug. Uh, nope. That's the wrong spot. I always do that. I always go to the, where the stink bugs are and not to the actual trowel gulch. That's alright. Learned my lesson here. Oh, that's really not good. Uh, hey, Mr. Bombardier, are you like sleeping? Watch out! That beetle looks like it's attacking. Okay. Well, that was the goal, right?
Right, let's head back up to That's our little makeshift base. Oh well, whatever you are, I'm gonna dump <laughs> Yeah, buddy. All right, let's get that on. Well, we don't even have parry mastery yet. Oh. Parry mastery is always my first mutation. Uh, did we ever dig up grubs? Ooh, I hear you. Don't want to deal with Wolfie right now. get back over here. I'd like to make uh, the red ant club and then I think we're ready for the hedge. Uh, so let's see. Just kind of do whatever we have here. Sprigs, sure. Uh, do we have new quest? Yeah, I got three of them. Clover Shin Guards, Poncho, and then the Toad Swamp. Oh, that is so perfect. Okay, canteen upgrade, smithing station, perfect. And now we're just gonna go for the scanners next. Well, uh, we might need multi-story bases actually. Uh, but that's okay. I don't remember how much clover I got, but probably not enough. So, hot deposit. Thank you. Uh, we do want a red ant clubs. Red ant parts! Oh, jeez. There's the wolf spider. Yikes. Sneaking around here. Yo, Ant! Uh, hey, can I just fight like one of you guys? Alright, well that was all I needed, but I can hear Wolfie still out here. Ugh, there's two of them right here. Oh, I need you. Come back. Okay, Red Ant Club is a success. Make a bunch of bandages here. Uh, probably not gonna use spears nearly as much, but that's all right. Can I fix my boots? Nice. And what about another torch? Sweet. All right. So we need to hit Toad Swamp on the way. If I'm not mistaken, is it right in the middle or is it on the side? I, you know what? It doesn't matter. Let's just get down there. Uh, so my goal was I want to do each video. I want to be one game day. 
Uh, each game day is 48 minutes real time. Uh, so we're going to do sunrise to sunrise. Oh, I forgot to make the... Oh. That was dumb. All right. Uh, anyways, as I was saying, uh, I want to run till sunrise, and then that's where I'll uh, end this video. Uh, I just realized that I forgot to make the clover gear for the quest, so I'm going to have to make another workbench because I don't want to turn around. Uh, or do you guys think I can get through the hedge lab within 24 hours, 24 game hours? I don't know. Let's find out. Uh, oh, my old torch died. Oh, hi, water flea. Where are you? I lost him. You know what? It's not important. There you are. Hey, has anyone seen a giant battle toad? Uh, anyone? No, he's around here somewhere. Well, that quest kind of has priority, I think, right now. Uh, I do think he was in the middle of the pond, so I, I'm going to head back over here. shouldn't say pond, I mean the, the flooded area. All right, is he right here? There he is. Yeah. No! Come on. Are you serious right now? Okay, plant fibers. Okay, there's one and two. Perfect. Let's get this show on the road. You gotta breathe, Weevil. Whoa. All right, where are we on the map? Uh, we could go get coup de grass, but I probably won't be using it really. Just leave it for now. I think the goal right now is to try to get zip lines, get the reverse zip. I think that's gonna really keep things moving nice and fast. Uh, also, I'm not really focusing on uh, certain things because we're waiting on the tier two hammer and axe. Uh, so as an example, if I can't get milk molars, there's a lot of this map that I'm gonna have to revisit just to get them. So I haven't really made those things a priority yet. All right, we got hedge ascents, fantastic. New. Okay, got to be something we can analyze, right? Fantastic. Hello. This could work for my science fair project. Come 
Come on, give us Natural Explorer. We gotta be close to it by now. Maybe that spiderling tastes like popcorn. Yeah, probably not. Alright, quick pit stop. Oh, you know what I just realized? Need to put that in our hot bar. Expectations. All right, we got the survey scanner unlocked. At some point, that should help us out. So we got everything there. To scan for analyzed materials. Visit additional stations to expand the survey network. Um, let's see. Just drop out here. Continue along on our way. I see raw science, which always gets my attention. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, granola bars. For so long, I have felt taunted by the spiders of the yard. Climbing, crawling, skittering with the greatest of ease. Oh, and how they delight in violating my workspace. I can't take a single step without getting stuck in their confounded webbing. I'm wasting daylight running, climbing, surviving, traversing this broken lab. The entire yard, for that matter, has become untenable. Oh, is that the new fling man? We could set up an awesome disc golf course here in the yard. Assuming we could get a normal sized disc, I guess. I mean a tiny size one. Wow, I must be getting used to it down here. All right. All the raw science we can muster. Uh, what time is it? Almost 7 a.m. Yeah. Take Today, it. Trudy asked, uh, or rather insisted, I take oh, a break this from way. my work for a family day. I'll admit the argument that preceded my reluctant agreement was one for the ages. She just doesn't understand how important the work is. But in the end, all was not lost. As fate would have it, our little trip to Storm and Beaches Wave Park has given me fresh inspiration. A particular attraction sported a zipline over an undulating pool filled with sun-baked tubers, basking in the light of the cruel sun that baked them like red, red raisins. All right, this seems like a good spot to end it. We'll start the next video right here in the Hedge Lab. I think we're off to a great start. Looks like it's about 7.30 a.m. on day one. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Please don't forget that like button, and if I've earned it, consider subscribing, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!